Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Mary. I do skincare reviews on my channel. So if you're interested, then please subscribe and you will be notified every time a new video is uploaded. So in today's video, I'm going to talk about another product from the brand Pilgrim. And this time I have tried their Squalene Glow Moisturizer. The price of this product is 550 rupees and you get 50 grams quantity of this one. The packaging comes in the form of this dark plastic tub. The texture of this moisturizer is a little bit thicker than their retinol night cream and uh, slightly it, it's somewhere moderate. It's not very lightweight also and it's not very heavy also. So it's somewhere in between. The ingredients that they have added in this moisturizer is very interesting. Normally, I don't mention ingredient, a lot of ingredients by name. But I just wanted to give you an overview of what the ingredient list looks like. So, they have added squalene as they have mentioned in this um, on the packaging. They have also added alpha arbutin in this. They have added niacinamide and it doesn't contain any synthetic fragrance. But they have added three types of essential oil as a fragrancing component which is like rose oil, bergamot oil and tuberose oil. Apart from this it also contains orange peel extract, lemon peel extract and all of these ingredients. So basically it contains essential oil as fragrancing component and the fragrance is quite strong. Uh, so they have also added all of these different ingredients in this one. Now I want to talk about the claims that they have made about this product. So they say it hydrates, smooths uneven texture, locks in moisture, brightens and firms, fast absorbing and reduces fine lines and wrinkles, smoothens skin tone and texture. That's about it from the claims. Now I want to quickly share my overall review for this product. Now I have recently tried a lot of uh, products from Pilgrim, especially moisturizers and I already have a full review of their retinol night cream. So in case you are interested then you can check, check out those reviews. Now coming to this particular Squalene Glow Moisturizer, the texture is slightly heavier than their retinol night cream. But on application, the skin feels hydrated and moisturized. So I used very little quantity, like a pea-sized quantity and it was able to moisturize my skin properly. But the next morning, when I, uh, next morning after using this moisturizer, my skin felt excessively dry and completely parched. Now a lot of uh, moisturizers and other products that I use, sometimes they tend to dry out the skin. But... After using this moisturizer, my skin was so dry, like near my uh, nose area, like sides of the nose and certain areas of my face. It was so dry, like excessively dry, like as though a layer of the skin got stripped off. So that is not great. Uh, since they call it a squalene moisturizer and squalene is supposed to, you know, give you a lot of additional moisturization benefits, like it locks in the moisture in your skin. So this shouldn't happen with squalene moisturizer. As I mentioned in the ingredient section, they have added a lot of ingredients. Niacinamide is good, but along with niacinamide and squalene, they have also added alpha arbutin in this one, which is, um, again, then it becomes like a, mixture of too many things like as i mentioned it contains lemon peel extract then it contains uh the uh, uh, vitamin c as uh, sodium ascorbyl phosphate and then they have added alpha orbitin vitamin c plus they have added uh, added lemon peel extract orange peel extract so all of these things is like you know it's like a mixture like complete like too many ingredients so if you have sensitive skin I don't recommend this moisturizer at all for you like sensitive acne prone skin just stay away from this is my personal opinion because there are too many ingredients and there are very high chances that your skin can break out uh, because of something or the other in this moisturizer like if you're if, if you're used to using their products then it may work for you but I suspect there are chances that it can break you out because of the excess amount of like various ingredients added in this moisturizer. So in spite of the fact that it contains squalene, it still dried out my skin. So maybe something in the moisturizer did not 
sit well with my skin so uh, talking about the fragrance now all of pilgrims product contains fragrance whether it is synthetic whether they have derived from essential oils so far whatever i have tried from this brand they are all heavily perfumed even this one even though they say no synthetic fragrance added but the essential oil something that they have added in this one uh, when i check the ingredient list they have written rose oil and bergamot oil and all of these essential oils are added so the perfumey aspect is quite high it's not like mild or moderate it's very highly perfumed so if you in case you don't uh, use uh, products containing leave on products containing fragrance then you can skip this one retinol serums and uh, other active serums that i've tried doesn't cause this much dryness not even salicylic acid on my skin so uh, this is something that is not good that a moisturizer can cause the skin to become this dry so definitely i do not recommend this moisturizer at all there are much better products out there i have try i have got another moisturizer like a night cream from this brand which i will try and hopefully that works for me so let's see but it from my overall review of this pilgrim squalane glow moisturizer i hope you found some helpful information in this one and if you did please hit the thumbs up button make sure you subscribe for more such honest skin care reviews and you'll find a lot of these videos from the description box below and that's it from today's video i will see you in my next one bye